when I first saw the warning, I, I was really quite surprised because uh, it is an over-the-counter drug. It's, it's something that uh, I have in my medicine chest. My wife takes, takes a set of me of that. And I would never think of that as being on the list of top 10 or top 20 or top 50 uh, drugs that would in induce a serious drug reaction. Uh, we've been hearing in recent years about the effect on kidneys, particularly people who take too many pills, too, too high a dose. But uh, cutaneous reactions, one doesn't think of with uh, acetaminophen. Dermatologists now are very, very sensitive to uh, uh, Stevens-Johnson syndrome, and of course, TEN, uh, both because of the p possible prognosis of the conditions and the fact that uh, more patients are being referred to us early on in the case of drug eruptions. Uh, what we are not seeing that often, and we'll continue to see rarely is these over-the-counter drugs. We have to remember that these over-the-counter drugs can cause that kind of reaction, even though they don't cause it perhaps as commonly as some of the, uh, uh, the other drugs that are used, uh, particularly in hospitalized patients. I think the main implication of this warning is going to be on the primary care physicians whose patients are taking these drugs and will hopefully sensitize them a little bit more when they see a rash that they think might be a drug eruption of some sort to include over-the-counter drugs such as acetaminophen in their history taking and then to make them much more sensitive to referring to a dermatologist early on so that these patients can be treated appropriately. The take-home message really for the primary care physician is when you take that drug history make sure you ask about over-the-counter medications and the kind of medications that we think of every day as a, you know, a cold tablet, a headache pill. Uh, include that in your, in your drug history when you see somebody with a rash that might be a drug eruption. And for dermatologists, I think uh, the timing of this coming out at the beginning of a, of a summer academy meeting is going to spread the word very quickly. I know I'm doing a session tomorrow morning on pearls and my lead-off slide, I'm going to change it, is going to be breaking news uh, to talk about that.